and welcome to Thursday's phonics. Oh, that's a little bit tricky to say, isn't it? Thursday's phonics. I wonder which sound you can hear from last week's learning. That's right, the th sound. Excellent. This week's sound, we're going to be learning the O sound. O as in throw the snow. So if you see this, we're going to say O. And if we see this, we're going to sing throw the snow. O, O, O. So we're going to see. It's my turn to say O. O. Your turn to say O. Oh. Brilliant! Well done! My turn. Oh! Your turn. Oh! Excellent! So if you see this, we're going to say oh. This side will be throw the snow. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, you ready? What did you see? Oh! Oh! oh. Throw the snow, oh, oh, oh. Next one. <gasps> Throw the snow, oh, oh, oh. Ready? Oh, oh. Fantastic. Let's see which pictures we've got today. We're going to start with this one. This is O for snow. O for snow. This one is, what's the sound? O. O, that's right, well done. O for boat or row. Is it to row? So we've got O and row. Brilliant. Next picture. Are we ready? This is a tricky one. So we've got the sound today is O and we're going to mow. This is to mow the grass. Mow the grass. So we've got O and the word is Mo, excellent, well done. So we're going to see if we can read our green word today and we're going to have all oh, two diagraphs today. So it's oh, oh, fantastic. The word is throw. We're going to see if we can write our O sound. So I'm going to use my pen first and then we'll practice using our magic fingers. So we're going to start at the top. We're going to go round the orange. Then we're going to go over the stormy waves. We're going down, up, down, up and flick. So pop some magic into your fingers. So can you remember what we need to do? We're going to go, start at the top, we're going to go round the orange. Oh, or is it that way? Let's have a go. That way, round the orange. Then we're going to take our pencils off. Then we're going to go up and down the stormy waves. So we're going to go down, up, down, up again and flick. Excellent! So, I wonder whether you can think of words that have got that O sound. And I wonder if you can write any sounds that you have learnt over the, since you've started school. So it might be K for oh, cat. And maybe draw a picture or see if you could write the word cat underneath, for example. So it would be cat, or you might 
think of the, what, the sound d and write or draw a dog. So d o g. I did hear a really good example a duck. So that would be a d a k for r. Okay, k and kicking k together. Why don't you have a go at home, home learners, and we'll see you next time. Bye.